I think the most important thing to, to say is the score, the music. The music's very accessible, it's a very pop, poppy uh, um, score, and it's um, written by Frank Welton. And I, I guess some people might be familiar with his work with Whitney Houston. Um, it's a great show, great production, great production values. And you get to see, uh, you get to not only see me, but some great uh, leading ladies as well, and Sarah Earnshaw and Sabina Carter. They were just wonderful singers, and it's a great uh, love triangle goes on within this, uh, in the show, and it's a great two and a half hours of escapism. Mm -hmm. If I answer your question <laughs> on your wee tiny phone, indeed. No. <laughs> <laughs> and um, of course, it's, a, it's it's also known as a, a great gothic horror story. Oh, absolutely, Robert Louis, Louis Stevenson story. Yeah, sure. um, so, how much horror will we actually see in the show? Well, it, it has to be that you know. I think that. You know, within the piece, you know, there's a, there's a few people get uh, done away with, for the want of a better phrase. And so, yeah, it's, it's quite, it, it is intrinsically dark, you know, and, and, and dealing with good and evil. And man's darker side and the, the, the plight for, uh, to rid the world of evil, which is for a lot of task in itself. Indeed. And did you have to do special training for those scenes, for perhaps like the murders and mm -hmm. that kind of thing? Yeah, there training? was fight, you know, the, yeah, the, it's, it's all choreographed, you know, so the, you know, there was, uh, what with Terry, who did a lot of the scene, uh, the fight scenes on the, the Bond movies and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So he comes in and shows you how to kill with great ease. I, th mm -hmm. I would often ask Terry, I say, how do you sleep at night? He said, very easy. Very easy. <laughs> <laughs> you shit under his bed. <laughs> you know, you think, you think. But there, there, there's a way to, uh, the, 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 you choreograph it to make it look alike, and you think, oh my God, that looks so real. And of course, you're coming to Manchester in March, and do you enjoy coming to Manchester? Is I'm going to spend my birthday in March, 21 again. Yeah, that's a big leap of faith there, watchers, viewers. But yes, uh, I come to Manchester. I've been coming to Manchester for many, many, many years, and you know, enjoy it. Hey, you've got trams. Indeed, oh, but... yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unlike Edinburgh, where well, they're coming, they're mm -hmm. coming, they're coming, they're coming. We've got the trams, but uh, big changes in your city. It's a it's a city that's that uh, that enjoys entertainment, good entertainment. There's a great um, uh, embracement of the arts here. You know, by the lovely, by the the Opera House by the Palace, you know, it's, it, the list just goes on because you enjoy your arts and a very cultural city, I don't know.